and this giant tree fell through our fence, barely missed our fire pit. And it seriously looks like <laughs> it looks like pee. Behind the braids. So in today's episode, you're gonna see us go on a girls date and go get our nails done and hang out at the mall. You're also gonna see a little bit of what goes on when Paisley gets her hair done. Mm -hmm. And we had a major catastrophe happen. We had a tree fall in our backyard, so that was crazy. Yeah, it was huge and it was super fun. We actually got to climb all over it, but you guys will see that in the video. And then we had a special treat arrive. We had Inca Cola, which is from Peru, and we all seriously love it, but we haven't had it in a long time, so we ordered some and it came in and we tried that. It's Super good. But before we get onto the video, y'all, this is our last week before we start tour, so you'll definitely need to get your tickets. And don't forget that you can get 25% off of your VIP tickets by clicking the link down below or clicking the information button right over here. So you guys definitely do that. We wanna see all of y'all on tour. We're so excited. We're gonna be singing three originals and two covers which haven't been released yet. So we're super excited. It's gonna be so much fun and it's our last week, so you'll definitely get tickets. And let's get onto the video. Toothless grin right there, buddy. <laughs> Can you open? All right, we're gonna put this little glass in there. We're gonna bite. Good job. Mm -hmm. You look cool with those glasses on. <laughs> this arrived today. <laughs> Wonder what this is. Oh my gosh, this is an intense box. Wow. All right. How does one even. All the sides pull the paper off. Open this. Dun dun na na! That's way everything I thought it was gonna be. The Webby Award! People's Voice Award winner, social content and marketing celebrity such fan, Brooklyn and Bailey McKnight. The Webby Award. How are you gonna share it? Are you gonna cut it in half? Who like, gets it? Like this. Bailey gets it. What the heck? I was going to just like share it with you. You just took off. <laughs> nice. Congratulations, girls. Also, what else Woo! happened today? They got accepted to their first university. Woo, 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 woo. So if anything, we are going to college to, at Harding University. First of many. Even if we get rejected by everybody else. <laughs> and we're so, <laughs> so excited about that. Harding is a good school. Yep. So what do we have here? Inca-Cola. This is Inca-Cola, and this is from where? Peru. Peru. It's Peru. You guys learned to love it when you did ATFY oh, there, yes. right? Yes, it's so Hey, wait. First, I have to explain. My dad lived in Peru for several years. He was a missionary there, right? He came home oh. always talking about Inca-Cola and how good it was, and we thought he was crazy. And then one time he got some Inca-Cola, and it seriously looks like urine. <laughs> it looks like pee. And they drink it, it in really Peru good. in, like, clear old like bottles, so it looks like pee, too. Mm -hmm. But this is, like... You know how big Coca-Cola is everywhere in the world? In Peru, yes. uh, it is this soda. It technically is like, I think lemongrass and banana. Dax has never had it before. Corey's never had it before. So Can we're I? gonna let him try it. Me? Yeah. Let's see what Corey, let's see Corey thinks here. Mm. It's kind of like a cream soda, uh -huh. but it scared me because at first it has this slight smell like there's alcohol in it. Uh, no, we're not being alcohol. No alcohol. Yeah? Just caffeine. What do you think, bud? What's it taste like? Bubble gum. Bubble gum? Here's Ryland. Here's Camry. I might not like it because it's hard. It's something kind of similar. Let's see here. Inca Cola. Okay, Camry. Where's the peas? Ryland didn't like it. It's what? It's wrapped Oh, Ryland doesn't like carbonation, I forgot. Like What's good, it taste like? Tastes like banana. See, some people pull bubble gum, some people pull banana. It's good. It's good stuff. It actually tastes like banana bubble gum. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so we literally just got home today. Uh, Camry and Ryland called us and said that there was an accident in our backyard and that we had to come home right away. And so I'm gonna show you a little bit of what we've got going on here. So there used to be a great big tree on the other side of the creek in our backyard. There's a neighbor over there, their house is over there. And you can see it down there in the creek, it got dammed up and that the water washed away the roots and this giant tree fell through our fence. Um, 
barely missed our fire pit, looks like. Big giant tree here. All the way through, took out half of our yard up into the pool. I mean, this thing is huge. Just walking around here. My gosh, we just laid this sod yesterday. I don't know if I should be walking under here. There might be a branch that'll fall. Oh my gosh, it took out some of our trees over here too. Our, our trees that we've had forever. And a lot of our fence line over there is broken. So yeah, I mean, just when you think that things are going okay and you finally have your yard done, you find, you find this unfortunate thing. Give you another shot here, there's Mindy. Mindy gives you a reference to the size of that tree. That's all of that tree right there. Going up to there. Seriously, I can't believe this happened. Like I would have thought a windstorm or a hailstorm or an ice storm would have done this, but this is this is all one tree right there. All those big branches you see, all part of that tree. Sean said it wasn't safe to climb the trees because it was unstable. So Camry and I promptly climbed the tree. So some of my other children are now following suit. Learning from their mother's poor example of how to actually have fun when a tree falls in your yard. a ginormous tree that fell in our backyard but they are cutting it down today and it's pretty insane to watch like you get a really clear visual of how large this tree is just look the guy is literally hanging in the tree okay so here we are this is day two of tree removal and you can see how far they've gone and Got some, there's our buddy right up there trying to remove the top of this tree. But yeah, this is a three day tree removal to get this thing gone. Okay, to give you an idea of how big this tree is, just look at my hand. That's pretty big. Okay, so that piece that he cut off right there, he says weighs about five to 600 pounds. So, we're chilling at the mall for a second because we're getting ready for tour. We're doing some last minute shopping for makeup, and hair we're stuff, nails. we're doing nails, time for prep. All right, so the mall day is accomplished. We got all the makeup and stuff that we oh, wanted yeah. for tour. And now we are going to Target and then to get our nails done. These babies are not done right now. And you can see I the lipstick from I don't from ever Sephora. get my nails done <laughs> unless it's like homecoming or something. So I know, so this is it's, a first. it's a good occasion. To and we're trying, nails, you know, Mike and then Nick, yeah. Yeah. we're trying the new like next kid. Hi guys, this is Crazy and today's Nikki's doing my hair. And Mommy, Cammy, Brooklyn, Bailey, I out. Hey, I'm back! Today, I wanted to show you my hair. Let's you got them. just a little bit more left, right? Mm -hmm. Who are you holding? Ashy. Ash, is he being good? Uh-huh. Yeah? Not growling. Not growling? Mm -hmm. what, do you, what do you do while you get your hair done? Watch. Again. You're watching Peppa Pig, right? Yeah. Yeah, you sit pretty still, huh? Mm -hmm. It takes a long time to do her hair. Yeah. Yeah, that's why we like having professionals that can do it much faster than Mindy, right, Nikki? Mm -hmm. yeah, sure. <laughs> awesome. We'll show you when it's done, all right? Yeah. I'm gonna show you my hair. It's finally done. There's a side in the back. And I can't wait until I go to church like this. And I can't wait until mommy gets back so I can show her. Bye guys! So it's official. 
that Bailey and technically I are the only ones that are originals in this family because Bailey got pink nails and purple toes. Purple toes. I did black nails, which is pretty much what I do most of the time, <laughs> and white toes, which I normally do. Mom, we met. Oh no, but then Camry and Brooklyn decided to. To be fair, my tour outfit is red and black, so I had to get black nails. And then mom suggested I get these toes, so I and did. Camry ended up with. Camry's the copycat. She copied me. She, co she copied Brooklyn. <laughs> I'm pretty sure Brooklyn's match mine. So yeah, Bailey's Bailey's definitely the original. Everyone in the uh, nail salon was laughing because all three of us got the exact same thing, which was comical. Thank you guys so much for watching. Y'all definitely be sure to buy tickets for our tour. We are having a sale right now, which is 25% off all VIP tickets, so click the link right over there and buy your tickets and comment below which city is closest to you once you click that link. Also, if you wanna watch more of our videos, click the, ring, the box right below that and subscribe to our channel. We love you guys and we'll see you next week. Bye! Mwah.